Our fleet trackers are an OBD2 device that plugs into the vehicle to provide full telemetrics data in real time. Today we will be installing the light version fleet tracker. For this installation, you will need the OBD2 device and the serialized security zip tie. If you are using a Y cable, be sure to grab that too. Before you install your fleet tracker, be sure to note the serial number on the box and product. You will need that to activate the device. Locate the vehicle's OBD2 port. The port will be located under the vehicle's dashboard area, usually below the steering column or in the lower driver's sidekick panel. Consult the vehicle's owner manual for the exact location. Attach the EchoMaster Fleet Solutions device to one side of the Y cable. Remove the vehicle's OBD2 port and plug the factory communication port into the other side of the Y cable. If you are not using the Y cable, you can plug the product directly into the OBD2 port. Once the fleet tracker is installed, start the vehicle's engine and let it run outside for five minutes, allowing the device time to read the vehicle's identification number. Please note, vehicle must be outside with an unobstructed view of the sky for its first location to be set into the application. EchoMaster Fleet Solutions provides a security zip tie to ensure the OBD2 device stays securely in place. Install the security zip tie around the device and the accessory harness and cut off the access cable. We recommend recording the zip tie serial number on the activation card located in the box before installing it around the OBD2 device. Once you install the device, you can activate your product at activatemyechomaster.com. For any additional questions, please visit echomasterfleetsolutions.com.